and let me put it on the other side also how does this feel to you how does it feel to you and now again we are going to use the water tap this is what we call as subscribe to boost up station if you haven't and today we are going to test the ip 65 rating of this t7 sealed ssd from samsung so you can see in the front we have the water dropping down and here we have the sand so we are going to use this sand on the ssd so i am going to hold this ssd in this direction in this place and let us drop some sand but before that let me put the sand in this little so now this is full so it fell down but it is okay it is drop resistant also and we are going to put sand on this you can see like this and let me put it on the other side also and they say that it is dust resistant so now this is completely in the dust make sure you save it from the port side because the sand may not come out from the port from other sides it is water and dust resistant but i don't think it is from the port side so now it is in the dust let me put some more here and we will also be checking it into the computer so it is dust resistant that is why the dust is not sticking on it now let us do the water test so in the front we have this water tap and you can hear the sound of the water coming out now i'm going to wash it you can see washing my hands and washing the ssd samsung t7 seal this is how it is showing us the water and the sand resistant i am washing it from the port side also to show you that whether it will work or not so continuously we are washing it you are able to see now let us dry it with a cloth cotton cloth you can dry it are chup ja from all of the sides you can dry it using a cotton cloth and if some sand sticks here you can use the water tap to clean it up let me show you once again now this is dry still we have some sand left so again we are going to do the same process and from this side also perfect now it is fully empty the box so let us again use the tap to clean it up and here we go what is coming out let me clean it up we are washing it you can see it the water is a little bit hot because of the summer season i am washing it from all of the sides so that no sand is there on it and i really love the ip65 rating on it that it is both water and dust resistant 
the last time we are going to use this somewhat wet sand let me place it like this i am going to use like that how does this feel to you how does it feel to you and now again we are going to use the water tap this is what we call as dust and water resistant ssd from samsung you can clean the ports you can see this is from the port side you can see this is the port side so i'm going to clean it up like this now our ssd is fully clean from all of the sides you can just throw the water from it and a little bit of water is there inside the ports also but it will dry after some time from here and now we have a clean ssd and as i already told you you can use a cotton cloth to wipe it out this is the port side what you can do is if there is some water still left in the port side you can throw air from your mouth so i'm going to use it so now i can see that there is no water inside the port the port is also clean so we have successfully washed our ssd with both soil and water and now we are going to do the drop test on this samsung ssd t7 shield it is 3 meter drop resistant so let me take it a little bit far from here and till this height it is around 2 meters height and i am going to drop it from here and you can see 3 and here it is you can see it so it is a bit in the soil you can see so let us wash it now because i don't like this soil on this ssd so let me wash it for you and here you go it is water resistant also soil resistant as well as drop resistant you can drop it like this if you want you can drop it like this as many times as you want it is resistant to all water soil and drop up to 3 meters you can play with it like this you can play with it indian games are there to play like this it is perfect and after washing it out you can use a cotton cloth like this to remove the water from it from all of the sides you can use like this from this side a little bit of water may be there from the port you can throw some air here and that is it now i am going to show you that this is still working inside our laptop or android device so let us go to the laptop now and try connecting this ssd whether it works or not so now after the water drop and dust test we are going to check if the ssd is still working or not make sure you clean up the usb port of the ssd from the water by throwing some air from your mouth or the dryer whatever you have now i am plugging in the ssd and the light is blinking it means it is going to work let us see there is no prompt in the mac os i am going to open the finder and you can see here 
it is showing us t7 shield let us open it up and here we have all of the data without any kind of problems right there are no problems in the data we have so it is intact it means the ssd is still working even after the water drop and dust test and the buy links will be given in the description and many more videos related to the same ssd and other samsung ssds are given in the description kindly watch them so please subscribe to boost up station and that's it for now thank you for watching now it's time to discover more simply click on the screen to subscribe to our channel and watch another video to discover more